Okay, the hellhound thing about gave me a heart attack. I've been walking here for a while to so be used to these. Of course, this particular one's not. This is, has not been walking. They got it fixed apparently. Good grief. The one there has not been walking. That's the first time it's walked since I got here. I think they fixed it. Something to do with the power cord, the stencil cord. Lots of stuff here. I know I gotta clock in here in a few minutes. Spirit had wings inside the old Kmart. There's a couple of the owls from Kmart, the sopping owls. Trying to do a more a better video because I the other day I didn't have time to do a too long a video. Came out something to do a little bit more of a video. I missed those; they were right there, and I forgot to put them in the video. Of course, then you got the pharmacy back here. That really freaked me out, though. The one thing that's not been walking since I started here is now walking. And kind of caught me off guard. The conveyor belt system still works. All those equipment. I miss Kmart. The one on Patrick Street apparently is in Salston and apparently it's a big stores hub thing for U-Haul. Oh, this is one of those rooms. I guess you have the tunnel light on. It's just a room with plywood walls. That's all it is. But this is the room I missed the other day. Now this room I can go in. It's just the old safe. No money left. But that's the old safe and vault they keep all the money for Kmart. Now Kmart back in the day was a big thing. When I was growing up in the 90s, Kmart was just starting to die out. That's a big speaker. Old school speaker, but I think it's cool they had all that huge save and they had an actual money room, all for last personnel only. <laughs> Back in the day, they had all that. Kmart had his own jewelry counter. You can go buy your own jewelry. They had a little diner, little restaurant where you could buy food. Well, it wasn't much restaurants, more like a little cafe, so it wasn't a full service restaurant. You get more like a snack bar. There's a lot of stuff they had. Kmart's a lot, a lot like Walmart nowadays. Sim well, not as fancy as the Walmart stu Super Center because they didn't have the thing where you can get oil stains in your cars and stuff like that. But you can get a lot of groceries and get school supplies for your kids. For schools, basically adult clothes, kids, whatever kind of clothes they needed. You had your own pharmacy. Yeah, you enjoy jewelry counter where you can buy jewelry. There was so much that Kmart had. They even had the red and blue light specials. Walmart does not do the blue light specials. But the reason I kept paying the Kmart to Walmart, Walmart is actually a lot like Kmart was, except for doing more like an upscale thing. They don't do this blue light special, and they do offer. Well, I don't think, I think Kmart is the only place they ever done that blue light special. Those of you who don't know what it is, it's when they would put some random mile on on sale, run uh, some random item in the store would go on sale. You wouldn't know what it was until they did it. They might say, for the next hour, all laundry soap is 50% off on our such and such. But it's funny because we so often they just go to the intercom system and announce something random and you never knew what it was until they said it. I think only the employees that came on knew what they were going to put on sale. I'm going to go through these double doors. I'm going through a portal to another the Vitson. The Vitson back to Spirit Halloween. <laughs> then we'll get ahead in the video. Yeah, Spirit Halloween's got at least the whole building, but the only part of it is the store. It's actually not a bad place to work. Although, I think I had my scare for the day. The hell, I don't think it's popped. It's not worked since I've got here. It's walking now. <laughs> that was my good scare slash laugh of the day. <laughs>